Hello, welcome back. Um, in the uh, Peter Crouch podcast, um, I've been listening in and it's developing a bit of a momentum about this parched thing. Apparently in pre-season training, they were absolutely exhausted, people fall on the floor, drinks, desperate and parched for a drink. One of the players was that keen and that fit that he was just chatting with the, with the, with the manager and that since then he was always the first one to reply, he's always got his kit, he doesn't mind going on the bench, he'd play any position. So, it's not yet revealed who Peter Crouch's parch is, but Ben Stringer, who is parched at Newark? Well, I think um, we might have had a couple of candidates across a few seasons, but I think this season, probably have to say Dino. Yeah. Oh, he's left now. Well, he's, <laughs> yeah, he's, he's, but yeah, Dino, he was a good lad. He's always first to reply. He, yeah, first to reply. Um, did all the things that a manager would want him to do. Uh, fit as a fiddle as well, so maybe he didn't need as much drink as he was. <laughs> yeah, I know in the second team that uh, Jasper Cramp was definitely parched. Yeah. He was there for the first day before he even got in the squad, he bought all the kit. Um, paid his subs, uh, always there early. So um, You always need a few of them in the, in the squad. Um, is Luke Hawkins parched? He's, um, he could say he's half parched. <laughs> Half, we go with half parched. <laughs> I think when Peter Crouch reveals it, because they've ruled out Scotty Parker, Joe Allen, Steve Sidwell, Glenn Whelan. I think, think? I think parched could be James Milner. He's, he's a good candidate, isn't he? He's there. I think it could be him. I'm not sure, but it could be.